in a hidden dungeon that nobody could recall. Suffering alone for many years in the musty air, a silent spirit clings dearly to the walls. He awaits the return of his departed master to want and spare in revenge. Fading himself from dungeon to past life memories in which he relives in scenes back and forth again. Many, many years on a soul's quest to once and in vain. The master did not recognize himself as such when he did indeed by fate reappear to that dungeon once again as a new man. A group of young explorers excitedly bade the dark room along the weighted lighting. The silent spirit faded onto the scene causing the dungeon's doors to slam behind the recognized master tight. All of the other explorers were barred out from walking within. The spirit of the master deep within the young explorer quickly felt a deja vu that he could not shake with a tremendously guilty and heart-wrenching fear. His panic quickly filled the room as he was unable to see or hear anything from beyond the door. Just the clicks and cracking sounds, the creaking of the floor. Hours passed and the outsiders soon went on with life. Hours turned to days as the newly awakened master clung on to consciousness in the blackened room without quality air, hardly any sound and completely no light. The silent spirit took closure in seeing the master returned to him, the same sick and sadistic pain that the silent spirit once endured from the wall and chains. As the master's soul finally released into the beyond, the silent spirit allowed the doors to open. It wasn't until weeks later he was found. The silent spirit then moved on. He had even the score. The dungeon, in later years, became overgrown by hills and plant life and could be discovered no more.